Okay, I have to do this really quickly before I get everything. It took so long to get to the air side. Again, still at YVR. Um, was one of the first people to, to line up for the gate, even before it opens. And um, maybe the fourth person went through the security actually really quickly. Um, there were a lot of security staff, so it's. Um, Seems that they still want to process people really quickly, mm, and then the border took a while. It's interesting to see how as different kind of organizations um, they process people like factory. So it's a little bit slower. Um, anyhow, things got. A lot more quiet inside compared to the um, from the land side. It's not a lot of big machinery, so it's really quiet. There's no one around. Um, even in the custom, you can still hear the it's just the ventilation. There's a lot of people in the um, the space was I guess were made for, to to hold a lot of people, and so the the air, um, the the rate of air intake is can feel it's really high. It's really cold. It gets a little bit more comfortable here, and um, it's really weird getting inside. I was one of the first people to get through. Mm. It's really quiet, but right from the get go, they there's um, what is it? The duty free store is blasting some Latin music. Kind of out of place for something that's happening at like 4.40 a.m. And now it's almost time to board the plane. Um, the terminal is long, so just walking back and forth already took 20 minutes and plus taking some pictures and footage. And um, I'm in the smaller terminal because I guess it's for the smaller planes. You can notice the, the elevation drops. Um, and uh, interesting thing was that they kept um, Nancy explained this already, but um, for transporter they have to keep um, arrival and departure uh, passengers separate. And um, so as I walk around, you can kind of see the separation. Right. For something terminal, people go upstairs, and then there's a elevated walkway that's a little bit more difficult to figure out. But um, for this little thing here, they just kind of cut everything in half. Mm. Everything's still close, I guess, except for Starbucks. And um, I like the smell of the main terminal better. It smells like food. It just feels like a hospital here. But quite busy. I guess people are flying on the, the earlier planes or smaller. Alright, just wanted to get that out, see if I'm missing anything. I, I was weird. When I got to the the body control, I was like one of the first people so I was just standing there for a while and before I know it, the lineup was already really long. Anyway, this is a totally random update, let's get it done and upload it here because the internet is so fast. It's so tired now. It's already 5 a.m. I have to speak really quietly because it's so quiet in here. Hopefully it doesn't pick up, otherwise I'm screwed. Alright.